the, the historical bias in Europe. Because there is, of course, have been many clashes between, especially the Ottoman Empire and Eastern Europe. And, uh, and I already said it in in uh, other interviews. But for example, you have the croissant, the, yeah. the bread, and it. A lot of people like the croissant. And it's a nice bread. It tastes okay, and it's <laughs> but it's shaped in 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 a half moon, in a crescent moon, and that's yeah. why it's called the croissant, crescent. It's from uh, the moon, and they baked it in 1683 for the first time after the Ottoman Empire was defeated by the Christian uh, armies in Vienna. Yeah. And then they broke it to show, well, we break Islam. So, and it's not uh, not that a lot of people know that, of course, in in uh, in Europe. But it's to show that the anti-Islamic uh, culture is very much alive, although it's not conscious. But there are so many symbols in it, and I, I can uh, uh, sum up uh, some other examples. But uh, there are a lot of uh, uh, symbolism in European culture that is very anti-Islam. So the combination of this historical bias as well with the terrorism and the denomination of my church uh, that made me, yeah, made me uh, hating Islam.